Hey guys, this is Chris with Optimize OS. Today we're going to be talking about a trending topic called ransomware, and I'm going to be doing a ransomware defender review for you of some software. You can actually download a free trial of it or learn more by following that link on your screen or visiting our website. That link's also directly under this video. But first I want to talk to you a little bit about what ransomware is and how it works. And as you can see from this image on my screen, this is a picture of ransomware that got on someone's computer. And what it does is it locks your computer so you cannot access any of the files on it. Uh, there's no way to get access to it because the files are encrypted and the only way to uncrypt them is by sending them money and they will send you a certain code to enter and that will unlock it so you can get at your files um, back so here's a couple other images you can see this one says three hundred dollars uh, it just varies I've seen them from a hundred dollars to go way up to over a thousand even and just a couple more and usually they'll only give you anywhere from two to three days to make that payment and uh, if you don't then they won't give you access to the key and if you don't get access to the key you lose all of your files and you're never able to get them back so that's why it's pretty important to have some kind of a ransomware software installed on your computer that will protect you from it so it'll never actually run and uh, encrypt all of your files and that's why we're going to be looking at Ransomware Defender, a very basic tool. Uh, but what it does, it does well, and it protects your computer against ransomware. And so here we can see the interface of the software. And it only has a few options, which is really all you need. Right here you can see that the threat definitions are turned on. The circle here is green. So it's going to be updating for us, constantly getting the latest definitions. So if ransomware does spread out like it did here a couple months ago when there was a global cyber attack and there were countless computers in over 150 countries that, uh, that got ransomware on them, uh, that's why it's important to leave the threat definitions on so it's only always updating. Then there's your active protection you can turn on and off and your scan here. You can do a quick scan, only takes about a minute. A deep scan will take a little bit longer or you can choose to do a custom scan on any area of your computer or external device, whatever it may be. Um, over here under manage, here you can manage your history, your quarantine, blocked risks, allowed risks and schedule scans of your computer. And then under the tools it has a few neat um, options here where you can clean your history out you can uh, you have a file eraser here to securely delete files from your computer and a startup manager to disable applications that run on your computer during startup to make it faster so really quickly under the ransomware defender main screen here all you do is click scan and that's it and it's going to run through and it's just going to run through really fast and do a scan show you if anything's been infected. If it has, it's going to remove it. And it will continue in the background to protect your computer. So if ransomware is installed, so it will not encrypt any files on your computer and lock your computer so you will not have access to any of those. So if you don't already have some type of a ransomware prevention software on your computer, I highly recommend this one. This one seems to work very well. Uh, you can download it there at that link on your screen and like I said you can also follow the link under the video there and you can visit our website where you can learn more about it.